Hello students and welcome back. Today we are going to discuss difference between circular motion and rotational motion. For that student, I'm going to consider orbital motion of the earth as an example of circular motion and spinning motion of the earth as an example of a rotational motion. We know students, in the spinning motion of the earth, or the earth rotates about an imaginary axis which connect north pole and south pole through its center this imaginary axis is known as axis of rotation so in the rotational motion of the earth you can see student axis of rotation is the part of the earth in the other word student i can say that axis of rotation lies inside the body that is earth in the case of a circular motion of the earth an imaginary axis is passes through the center of the circular path and perpendicular to its plane of motion this imaginary axis in the circular motion is also known as axis of rotation but here you can see the difference student this axis of rotation is not part of the earth or other word, this axis of rotation is not part of the body which performs circular motion, but it passes through the center of the circular path and perpendicular to its plane of motion. From this, we can say, Turing, in a circular motion, axis of rotation lies outside the body. In the case of a rotational motion, axis of rotation lies inside the body. We know student, the distance between the sun and earth is very, very large. So when we compare the path of motion of the earth around the sun, which is much, much longer than the size of the earth. Therefore, the earth is acts as a point body during circular motion. When I consider the rotational motion of the earth and compare its size with its path of motion i will observe that student path of motion of the earth about its axis is much smaller than the size of the earth therefore the earth in this case is acts as an extended body from this i can say student or the rotational motion path of motion is much smaller than the size of the body but in the case of a circular motion path of motion is much longer than the size of the body. Now, next difference. In the rotational motion of the earth, position of the earth does not change. To visualize this, let's consider the spinning motion of the top. When the top spins, it doesn't change its position. Similarly, the spinning motion of the earth or rotational motion of the earth does not change its position. But we know, student, the earth changes its position in the space. So this can be happen because of the circular motion. In the circular motion of the earth, earth changes its position. This situation you can compare with the motion of the sling. In this situation, stone changes its position during its circular motion. From this, we can say, student, in the circular motion, body changes its position. But in the case of a rotational motion, position of a body does not change. Now let's summarize difference between circular motion and rotational motion. First difference, axis of rotation lies outside the body. In rotational motion, axis of rotation lies inside the body. Next difference, path of motion is much longer than the size of the body. In the case of a circular motion, path of a motion is much smaller than the size of the body. In the case of rotational motion. Third difference, position of the body changes in the case of a circular motion. In the case of a rotational motion, position of the body does not change. A brain exercise for your student. On the similar line, explain 
motion of a fan is an example of a rotational motion but the motion of a point on blades of the fan is the example of a circular motion answer in the comment box thank you